Hey everyone, Crossover here with another Let's Play. Today we're playing Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door. Now this is the second installment of the Paper Mario uh, series. I would play the first one, but I currently do not own it. Yeah, I will create a save file. Should have done this before, man. For those of you that don't know what Paper Mario is, it is a an RPG game of the Mario series, where basically you're made of paper. <laughs> Mail call. Luigi. You don't actually get to use a Luigi at all, which kind of sucks. It'd be cool to actually use him. Hey bro, check it out. A letter from Princess Peach arrived for you. I'll just read it to you. How's that sound? Now let's see here. Hello there, Mario. I am now on holiday traveling in the Mushroom Kingdom. In my travels, I came into possession of a mystical map, a treasure map, actually. It was inside a box I got from an old merchant in, t in a town called Rogueport. But since it would be too difficult for me to try to go find treasure all by myself, I thought you could help me hunt for it. You will, of course, won't you? I've included the map with this letter. Please bring it with you when you come. I'll meet you at the Rogueport. That means you must come. Peach. <laughs> so demanding. That's Princess for you. What do you know? It's true. There's a weathered old map in here with the letter. Check it out. The prologue. <clears throat> A rogue's welcome. Oh, sorry. Uh, please wake up, sir. The town you've been speaking of has come into view. Look, that's Rogueport. You see, we will arrive shortly. Please, pre please prepare to disembark. I must apologize, sir. Our arrival was delayed just a bit by rough weather. Are you quite sure you want to disembark here? I did tell you all this. Sorted tales about Roport on our way here, did I not? What's that? I'm sorry? You say there's a princess waiting here for you? Is that so? Er, uh, of course, sir. Well, if that's what you think, then I won't stop you. But, uh, you be careful, sir. Don't say I didn't warn you. Oh! Huh? Well, you can't... That shows you can't enter the. Oh, uh, hang on one second. <laughs> Maybe that's why I was having such difficulties earlier. In the last game I was playing, uh, my controller was pulling slightly to the uh, front. 
Let's see if that fixed it. Um. Hello? Oh. It would help if I put in the first player slot. Much better. I'll just save since we're here. You know, just, just to see what you get. Anytime you get into the water, that happens. And you do take a point of health. Hey, what do you want? Get away from me, freak. Well, oh, come off it, you airhead. I know it's tough for you, but don't play dumb with me. I've seen you walking around town asking for information about the Crystal Stars. Well, now I'm doing the asking, so be a good girl and tell us what you know right now. Never. I don't have anything to say to you, creeps. Good. I suppose it wouldn't be right if a sassy little last like you met with an untimely demise. Bah. <laughs> Duh. Weird bah. Boys, we're taking this firebrand to our fortress. As you command, Lord Crump, we're on it. No, no, stop right there, you weirdos. I'll scream. Really? And that's where the hero comes in. Like I'd go in with smelly lunatics like you. <laughs> Not likely. Hmm? What do you think you're doing, Chunk? Do you think you can screw up with my plans? I think I just said, said that wrong. Yeah, it's always something. Looks like I'm gonna have to give you a little taste of the old crump a bomb. Okay. Can't flee this fight. Battle time, Mr. Man. Just find a way to beat this freak of the week, okay? Don't screw the details, just jump on him and hit him with your hammer. Jump. Sweet, you know that hurt. Wow. I gotta say, you're tougher than you look. Keep it up and you'll beat... <sighs> you'll beat him in no time. Oh. Missed the timing of that one. He got on the ropes, come on, keep wailing on him. You did it, you did it, yes, and you get star points. I bet you know. Yeah, I bet you know, but to get these things called star points whenever you win a battle, when you get 100 points, you go up a level. Don't forget that, okay? Got nine star points. Even though it says you get some every time you win a fight, I think eventually you don't get any from a weaker fight. So, uh, okay, well, okay, that, okay, you got a couple of decent shots in. I'll give you that. But, unfortunately for you, that means it's go time. Punish him. If I had the star ability, or special abilities, I would just wipe the floor with all those things. Okay. Aw. Can't hit them. Oh well. And... Bye. <laughs> Stop! Where'd they go, huh? Hugh Johnson, did you see them? Did anyone? Crud, they bolted. Wow, Mr. You totally saved me, thanks. I've just got to give you a little reward. My name's Goombella. I'm a student at the University of Goom. Nice to meet you. So, uh, who are you? Mario? Wait, you mean like that famous guy? Wow, I can't believe I met you here. Cool. Anyway, no offense, but it looks like you just rolled into town yourself, right? 
Me, I already hate it here. There are freaks and weirdos everywhere. It's nasty. I mean, I know the place is called Roport, so I had it. should have expected it, but sheesh. I never come to a place like this if there were some legendary treasure here. Oh, if you guys take a look in the background, you can see two, uh, I forget their names, but they're basically the characters from uh, Super Mario Sunshine. You'll get to see something neat if you keep watching the background. What, you're looking for the legendary treasure too? Seriously. Whoa, 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 bucko. What you got there? Oh my gosh, is, is, isn't that a treasure map? You have to tell me where you got that. Princess Peach? What? Great hoogly boogly, if it isn't Master Mario. Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna read the things in the background. Oof. Stay down, bro. The boss sends his regards. How'd that rope? I think I said road taste. Are you okay? That hurt. Those jerks. You won't get forget this. <laughs> Bit of a co coincidence bumping into one of another in this sort of place. Hmm? Ho ho. So tell me, Master Mario, what in the world brings you to this wretched little burg? Hmm? Ah, indeed. Prince P sent you a letter and a treasure map. And she told you she'd meet you here in Roport. Intriguing. Did you ask me where Prince Peach is? Mm, I was about to ask you that. Oh, sorry. We stopped in this town to acquire a spot of fuel for our ship, don't you know? I only took my eyes off her for a moment, but as soon as I did, she vanished. You know how headstrong she is, Mario. I just assumed she'd be back momentarily. But at this point, I fear we must embrace the possibility that she may never return. I've never been at a loss as to what to do. I've been fraught with worry, I tell you. But I'm feeling be better with you here, Master Mario. Surely we'll find her. Surely. But I know my place, Master Mario, and this is not it. I'll leave this task to you. I believe I'll recline in the inn right over there and enjoy a spot of tea, perhaps. In fact, I highly recommend it. Practically, if you find your HP heart points burning low, just drop on in. Uh -oh. Yes, anyways, a little rest there will fill up all your HP. I must say, though, the rest of the sound is a bit rough. Yes, rough indeed. Huff, I say. Huff, I say. <laughs> um, Princess Peach? Did you mean like Peach the Mushroom Kingdom Princess? The princess always really gets snapped by Bowser the Koopa King? The one you rescue? Wait a sec. This is crazy. Princess Peach sent you that treasure map. Whoa, this is really intense. Well, where could she have gone then? Do you think? Do you think maybe she got sick of waiting and went to find the treasure on her own? Oh, oh, I know, Mario. Go with me. One of my professors is here researching that treasure. We'll show him your map. If we start looking for the treasure, then maybe we'll catch up to your Prince Peach. Okay, we're all good then. Let's go, Mario. Most of is a primer. Press X to get information about nearby people, places, and objects. Oh, sorry. This is Roper Plaza. It's the center of town and the main business district. It's crossroads where many people meet, including more than a few shady characters. Anytime you press X when there's no one around, I'll tell you about them. Where are they? Ah, uh, tell about where we are. <coughs> That's Goomther, the Goomba. He's always complaining about being swindled or mugged. If you press X when there's somebody nearby, I'll tell you about him or her. So, did you get all that? Goombella can give you hints when she asks, or when she answers, so ask for information often. Now, of course, Goombella can be quite helpful in battle, too, or helpful. She jumps in the air to attack an enemy with a nasty head bonk. She can also look up enemy HP and weaknesses with her tattle ability. <clears throat> First off, we gotta go find my professor. The thing is, since I just got to town myself, I don't actually know where he lives. 
keep an eye out. Here's the professor's friend. Here's what Professor Frankly looks like. Okay, first things first. Freeze. You two, not another step. Don't come this way. Some complete jerk just bumped into me and made me lose my lose a contact lens. I'm looking for it now, so don't you dare move. You hear me? Whatever you do, do not move an inch. That not an inch, you hear? Now literally no matter what I do, it snaps. <laughs> Ah, idiot, you stepped on it. My poor contact lens. I told you not to move. Don't you don't your studio ears work? What were you thinking? This is your fort. Now I have to buy a new contact lens. Uh. <coughs> Holy crap. To buy a new contact lens, but you're gonna pay for it. Come take me, Mr. Clumsy. Fine, if that's your plan, then here's mine, you oaf. I'm gonna block the gate to the west until you bring me a new contact lens. Do this now. Welcome, yes, welcome to the Toad Bros Bazaar. Uh, what's that? You want a contact lens, you say? Hmm, wait just a moment. Fell. I'm sorry, but we don't have any in stock right now. Tough luck, I know. I can special order one right away for you, but it'll take a while. Check back soon, okay? Thank you. There's that. So I don't have to deal with all that talking in case the power goes out or something happens. Oops, pardon me, sucker. Hey, what's your beef, pal? Yeah, I'm talking to you. Mario, you gotta wake up. That guy just stole half your coins. Oh, he's a little punk. That is so lame. Ugh, I hate this town. Yeah. Well, if you actually go this way, after losing those coins, up here, around, oh, not you. And in here, you can find the guy that stole your coins. Yups. Uh, that's meeting you here. You're pretty dang persistent, buddy. What a pain. Fine, fine. Okay, you got me. I'll give you your coins back. Here. Thank you. You can get stuck on things so easy. Oh, map wonky. Now, in case you're wondering what this place is, you can get shine sprites from uh, from around the maps or the world, and he'll just. Oh, I'm just gonna skip that because it. He'll give your partner that you have a power up. Increase their power, their health, and giving them new abilities. Well, hi there. There you are, Professor Frankie. Frankly. What's that? Who's there? Who wants me? Ah, uh, yes. You. Now you. Uh, I've seen your face before. Yes, that face. Wait for it. Just a moment. Don't tell me now. Silence. I'll get it right away. Right. Yeah, I'll get it right. Um, it's not Goombrella. Uh, it's not Illusagoon. Hmm. Um. Aha, I got it. You're Goombella, aren't you? You were in my archaeology class last year, am I right? Oh, yes, sir, that's me. I'm Goombella, junior at You Goom Go Goombas. Of course I remember you. Not to toot my, own, my horn, but I'm pretty good at remembering. You, though, you stick out my mind because you are such an exceptional student. And that guy behind you is... Who? Mario, Professor. He's Mario, you know, the famous one. Oh, my apologies. I'm such a bookworm. I haven't, haven't a clue about what's hip right now. In any case, what sort of errand brings you to all the way to a place like this? 
We were hoping you'd tell us about the legendary treasure said to be in the below rope book. I thought that if anyone knew about anything about it, you would, Professor Frankly. Of course I know about it. The reason I came here was to study that very subject. Why do you types want to learn about the legendary treasure? Yeah, most people say it's a little more than a fairy tale, don't you? Oh, hang on, my throat is getting very dry. Archaeologists and historians have to search for truth in fairy tales, though. Me, I believe the legendary treasure truly does exist, exist, and I really want to find it. Good point. And we'll made it in that case. Well, well made. In that case, I'll cooperate with you however I can. First of all, about the treasure, there are many mysteries surrounding it. Some say it's infinity vast, infinitely vast treasure hoard, while others say it's a magical item. Some books say it's actually a monster, while st still others claim it's an empty chest. So many different theories, obviously it's impossible to define the truth among them. But all agree on one point, to find the treasure one must have the crystal stars. To find the treasure of yore, take the seven crystal stars to the thousand year door. You mean the crystal stars in that old thing that super elderly people pass down? Indeed, the same. As the saying goes, if you want to find the legendary treasure, you'll first collect the seven crystal stars. Hold the magical map aloft before the entrance to the thousand year door, then the stars will light the way that leads to the th stones of yesterday. Yeah, a lot of the lore I've read says that it, in this magical map it's taken to the doorway, and it'll show you where to find the crystal stars. Correct, and the thousand year door is supposedly here deep beneath the town. Yet the critical piece of the puzzle of the magical map is lost, if only we had that map. But we do have it, Professor, or well, not we exactly, Mario has a magical map. What? Uh... Okay, that is just weird, so I'm not even gonna bother. <laughs> you actually have it? Could I just take a quick look of it, at it, if you don't mind? Yeah, just hand over the important map. Astounding, this is it. The real thing. The one and only magical map. You, son, are my hero. You're great, fantastic, wonderful, even. With this, we can find the crystal stars just by holding the aloft before the legendary door. Right on, Professor. Good golly, what are we just sitting here then? Umbella, Mario? Off we must go this instant. Let's take the magical map to the legendary door. Um, okay. Okay. Well, unfortunately, that's all the time I have for. Oh, whoa. What was that? Did I touch something I shouldn't have? Well, either way, that's all the uh, time I have for this episode. So if you like the video, hit that like button, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.